So, welcome back. Now it's uh, time for part two of this uh, short uh, tying movie of the Durham Ranger, as you see here next to me. So, um, in this video, we're going to finish it off, and uh, yeah, hopefully, it's going to be uh, look all right. It's very, very hot today, uh, so so I'm I'm like melting. <laughs> so, but hey, why talk so much? Let's begin. Just added the thread back again. So uh, first step, uh, G's in the middle. So I pick the pair. There we are. That's twisting. Let me reset. And there we are, spot on. So I'm just going to add a little bit of varnish there to make sure it stays in place. And there we are. Some paper. Then I just gonna figure out how these are going to end up. So cutting a bit on the sides just a little bit I'm just trying to mount it Okay, so I'm gonna let the GC first dry. Spot on, that's where I want it. Adding some more varnish. And then we need to wait a bit for it to dry. It's a warm day today, so it should not take that long. Okay, so let's see if it has dried. Yeah, it's dry. So, cutting the leftovers. Yeah, it 
looks good. Trying to fit these ones and then be gonna add varnish again and let it dry for a while before the next pair. So let me see. There we are. with the one on my side. Now we have a better angle. Still too much pressure on it. I don't like it. Let me reset. I think we're gonna add one at a time. Quite nice position. So I'm gonna put some varnish there. Let it dry again before we add the next pair.
Okay, so I cut off uh, uh, the steam in the front. So let's see if we can add this one. side first then. Sounds a bit. happy with the feather thong. I think we need to try a few before we get satisfied. now but we'll look better later let me get the other one in place let me see what I got
external the theme Cutting off the feathers in the front just a little bit. Satisfied, need to be wider. So let me see what I can find. Maybe this one. Add some back still thread.
and then we add some varnish and then I let it dry for a bit and we add the sides the yeezy and then the, I'm gonna use pitta as the side feather First, let that dry and then we continue in maybe 10 15 minutes. Okay, so now it's time for the sides. Uh, so, we're gonna add some yeast here. Uh, first of all, I'm gonna wax the thread again. Um, so, let me start with that one. And I'm starting with your the side to, towards you guys side Then we add some more backs to the thread. There we are. Then I'm adding the pit down the side. I'm using quite large one. I didn't want to dig out a new neck. There we are. So, time for some varnish. And then I let it dry for a little bit. Give the dog some food. the topping and after that the horns and then the fly is ready okay so uh, now it's time for a topic so let me first wax the thread Get 
where it's supposed to be. And there we are. It's okay. It's not perfect in any sense, but it will do. I haven't tied flies in many, many weeks, so you get a bit rusty. But overall, I'm gonna put some varnish there and then find a good size horns to tie on. finish off the head and the fly is ready so let me see if I find some decent length Do. So, one fiber on each side. And my dog is making noises. After five years, he doesn't realize other people are living in the building. <laughs> so adding horn on one side. with the, the topping. So I think I'm gonna let the varnish dry. I just add the horns later and finish off the head and then in this movie showing uh, uh, the, the finished uh, fly uh, I don't need to show you how to put horns on I think you guys have done that plenty of times so that's the end of this video how to tie Durham Ranger uh, as you noticed uh, I'm a bit rusty I haven't tied flies in uh, yeah a few months uh, to bonus video uh, so so yeah I'm gonna catch up and i um, back as normal in uh, yeah one two maybe three flies uh, who knows but I hope you enjoyed the video and uh, if you don't uh, subscribing already please do so I appreciate that very much and uh, if you have a request of a pattern you want me to tie just let me know and I do my best uh, tying it and uploading the video as soon as possible so thank you all for watching and take care and have a, have a nice weekend and stay safe <laughs>